All right, gamers, welcome back. We're playing Atlas, and thank you so much for joining me. Hope you guys are having a great morning. We're back here in Atlas, and it seems to me like I'm bigger than my door. Am I bigger than my door? Looks like I might be taller than that door. Anyways, uh, we are back here at our, can we see it here? Iridium Ingot Farm. Ingots Farm, I guess, is what, I'm, is what we're going with. Um, I was checking the... Um, I was checking the wind there last night to see if we could set sail to the north, and it looks like the wind is pushing us south right now, anyways. And of course, it's what is it here, middle of the night? I think it's midnight or something. Almost midnight. It's 11 o'clock at night, so it's not often we do nighttime uh, missions and nighttime episodes because, quite frankly, it's so dark. But this and that, and I do have a little bit of a lantern going on here, so we're, we're, we should be okay. I just figured, you know what we can do while we're waiting for morning to come? I, I always keep going over here to the left. And um, using my grappling hook to get up on top of there. And I'm like, well, why am I using my grappling hook when I've got this nice little sheer area right here where maybe, like, maybe I can put some ladders and just ladder up, right? I mean, I don't I don't see why we don't do that. So I'm thinking if I go straight up there, maybe put a foundation or two here and then just have ladders. And then what we can do is actually put, like, um, a fence or something. Just fence ourselves in. There is absolutely no hostiles on this end of this little beach area. But there is over there. I think we saw him in the last episode. A wolf had spawned over there and he had kind of attacked us. I could put like some kind of fencing or something. I don't know. Doesn't matter. Uh, it's, it's not like Blue has a problem with them. I mean, unless they were Alpha or something. You know what I mean? But he's level 72 bear. Uh, he's doing pretty good, actually. If we look at his stats, you know, like 1,091 health. His melee damage is 188. So that's it's pretty good. He, he, he just, like, mops them up and every time they're showing up. But I figured, at the very least, I should have a ladder going up there. You know, because if we do spawn back here with absolutely nothing, like, I'm not leaving my bears behind, right? Just, if I spawn back here, I have a bed in here. I can spawn here anytime I want. I can come up here and just climb up. Climb up, get my stuff going, get the iridium ingots going. I already got 500. We've got something like... What's going? Well, we got another 500. It's going. It's going pretty good again. I'm thinking to bring about 1,500 ingots back with me. I don't know. We'll see. I'm hoping. I had to take some of the uh, iridium off the ship. I have a full cargo rack filled with iridium, and then a couple of stacks more in another one. So I've got all four of them going right now. And uh, as you can see, I got four cargo racks on that on that ship. Maybe you can't see that. So all that being said, let's um. See, do I even have foundations going here yet? I don't know that I do. No, stone foundations. I gotta make two stone foundations, and then we can kind of just... I think I'll do two. One is gonna look kind of weak sauce. So let's see what we can do here. What are we missing? Oh, I was out collecting a thatch. Correct. Let's go. We got one. We just need two foundations. I think we'll do that, and then we'll have, like, some ramps going up to it, and then we'll just have walls with... I mean, nothing fancy here. You know what I mean? Also, I'm collecting all the different resources on this island. Um, we have, like, obsidian and, and this and that. It's not too heavy, right? But I, I want to take some home with me. Uh, so that I have the variety and I can make all kinds of different stuff. Obsidian is like flint. Or what do they actually call it? Um, oh, they call it flint. Yeah, that's right. So they call it flint. And, and so the more flints you have, you actually use those for tools and weapons and things like that. So it's pretty important that you have a multiple variety of them. Um, in my opinion, anyways. So I didn't want to leave here without taking obsidian. I don't think that I have some of that back home. So we'll see. Alright, besides that, we're doing pretty good here. We're doing pretty good. We're in a little nighttime building here. And then we'll check the... Did I not take the? Uh, did I not take the foundations? Oh my life! Um, then we'll check the the wind again, see if it's changed in our favor. If not, we'll still head north. I think we are going to head north. I like that idea, and uh, try to get to H fifteen or whatever it was. There they are, hiding out in the workbench. They got to make your stone stuff in the workbench. Gets me every time. The wood stuff I can just do in my pockets, but not the stone stuff for whatever reason. Okay, so let's get this right, shall we? Let's get this right. Oh, I can't lift it up. Oh, okay, so I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I might just have to be quick here. I don't know, but let, let's take a look at these walls here. Okay, so if we go... Hmm, I'm not going to be able to do this, am I? Because as soon as I move down, yeah. Hmm. All right, so let's, let's just eyeball it then here. Okay, so this is going to be... This little corner, let's take that out of our face. And that little corner there is directly above, it seems, these stones. So if I kind of... This is going to be tough. <laughs> this is going to be tough for me. All right, let's go. Let's do this thing. So we got to go like this. So it's going to be kind of like there. Let, let's at least get the angle kind of right. That would be really sweet. So as a matter of fact, hold on a second. Where's our house? What would be good? We don't need to attach it to the house or anything like that. That house is too far away. But we're kind of going to swing around the corner over here, I'm thinking. And then I'm going to come here, right? So we kind of want to be maybe... We can always put some... Oh, we can always put some... Uh, Hello? I'm clicking. Ain't nothing happening. Hello? 
Okay, is it because there's stuff on the ground? Um, get this out of our... Maybe it doesn't... See, all this is garlic. Yeah, there's just so much garlic and stuff here. It's fantastic. This is going to take an eternity. Um, do we not have our sickle with us? We do. Oh, I thought this would be fairly easy. No, it's not going to... Maybe it doesn't let me build because I was underneath it here. Who knows? Let's see. What on earth are you doing, buddy? I don't think this actually has to be cleared out, but now that I'm seeing it, maybe it's a good idea anyways. Okay. I'm hearing noises. What was that? Okay. It says we can build here. So let's see. We kind of want it like this. Well, this should be fine, right? Right. Okay, and then if we quickly get the walls out... Would have been nice if it was on the bar, I know. <laughs> Alright, we've... And you know what? That's not going to be terrible. That's not going to be terrible. Although I, I hate the fact that I... Mm. Oh, okay. We're just going to take two walls down for the price of one. Oh, uh, no problem, bud. <laughs> this game. Game hates me. All right, let's go. We want... Let, let, let's let's just put... Can we just put bare wall? Oh, uh, no. What is this game doing? I thought I flipped it and then it gave me that and then it... Let's see. Okay, there we go. That's what I want. Red towards me. Actually, this is going to be all right. It goes straight up. Okay, okay, okay. And then... Oh, of course. Of course. I think we actually have enough walls, to be honest. Oh, yeah, okay, there we go. We don't need the fancy... Oh, we're gonna have to actually climb up there to get to this. Okay, so that's fine. And then I got myself like a little bit of ramps here so that we, I don't have to even jump at all. Just come running up and let's go ramps. Let's stick them like this. So we can just kind of come up here and use the ladder. I'll put the ladder maybe on the... Actually, let's put it on the left-hand side. How many do I even have? How many do I even have? Eight. Let's put them there. Oh, stink. Right, it's gonna... Would you stop this guy? <laughs> it's, it's not going to want to stick it on this side of the wall, is it? Oh, this game. <laughs> oh, my life. you got to be kidding me. It wants to put it over here. Why can't that put it on any side of the wall that I want? Hmm. Look at that. I'm queuing it all I want. It doesn't care. It's like, nope. And I press E. You can't flip this thing around, I guess. He'd rather just pick up bushes than... than Okay, all right, all right, all right. So I guess I've lost all these walls. Holy snap, and... I don't want to put the ladder on the weird... Oh, what does it look like here? Hold on a second. We can take a little quick look here. What does it look like? It's so weird, this. Oh, look at that. Did you see that? Look at that. Inside, outside. Hmm. So do I want it on the outside? I can climb up on this. Hmm. All right, I better pick that up. Well, that's odd. So I can't... But you must be able to put a ladder on the inside. How could you not put a ladder on the inside of something? No? No way. Oh, look at him. Look at him. He's doing it again. See, even here. Okay, so I press E. Nothing happens there. You press Q. It literally just wants to be on the other side. It, you can't put a ladder on this side of the... That can't be. Maybe I need to put foundations over here. That can't be. Because maybe by flipping the wall, is the wall not sitting on the foundation? Oh, of course it is. Well, that's odd. I could have swore I could put the ladders wherever I wanted. All right, well, let, let's not let's stop gawking at this. I might have to rebuild this here. I will go make more walls, and I will be right back. So I'm not sure what it is, actually. It looks to me like maybe it's the foundations? Because, I mean, look, I, I can put a wall all I want all day, every day, and uh, the ladder still doesn't... The ladder will go on top. In fact, the ladder will go right here, too. And we could just use this and, and climb up. I just don't think... Hmm. Can we pick this one up? Let's see. Can we climb up and put more? We, oh, we sure can. Alright, so if we climb up here... And then... Can we actually put a floor here? I doubt it. Yeah, no, we can't put a floor... We can't put a floor there, so we can't. We, we're climbing up to nowhere, basically. Um, oh, that was probably a bad idea. 
Okay, can we pick these back up? Fairly, fairly well. And not these ones. Okay, so you see what I mean? Like, I, I, I think maybe it's the foundation. That's so weird. Actually, well, hold on. I'll answer my question if I go like, because like, look, it's going to put it here, right? And it's going to put it there. And it's going to go way over there. Mm. But as soon as I put a wall, it's like, nope. So I'm not sure, like, why it wants to go on this side of the foundation. It's very bizarre to me. I don't know. So I'm going to have to fangle with this a little bit longer. I didn't, uh, I've never, <laughs> never encountered, I got to take all this down. It's too bad because I have to put the wall if I'm going to put, like, some flooring up there so that it'll, it'll go flush and I can just, you know, I don't want to be falling down off of a high ladder like that. So I'm not sure. I might have to... I don't know. Maybe I need to put four foundations. That might be the thing. We'll, we'll try a few things and then uh, we'll come back. All right. So no matter what I did, it uh, ladder only goes on the outside of the foundations. That I didn't know actually. All that building we did, and I never even realized that. But I've only ever put ladders on the outside of buildings. So I guess you don't. I don't know for whatever reason. I must have. I would have to have a hatch or something like that. Maybe you know what I mean. And then you can have like a hatch here and have it go out of a hatch, which is not a bad idea. Or I have to go like this. In fact. I'm not totally mad at the hatch idea. Uh, if I go like this. Not catwalk. Ceiling, ceiling doorway, I'm calling it hatch. Uh, if I go like this, and then I go like this. Can I have it on this side here? Yeah, I can have it right like that. Actually, maybe that's not a bad idea. Then we can enclose it, and I can kind of hide if something does come at us. You know what I mean? Actually, that's not a terrible idea. I like that. Um, so let's see here. We can demolish this. Cause I kind of had this idea here, but then I can put a ramp. It's just going to look weird. Uh, but let's demolish this here. Let's demolish this as well. Right, that was a bad idea. Uh, so, <laughs> oh my life. This is this is like way harder than I ever anticipated, right? I don't know what I'm doing. Nine. Let's go hatch right here. Hopefully that's the case. And we kind of go like this. And I can climb that, right? I sure can. And then... Come on, buddy. I see you. There. Okay. And then I guess we can kind of just go up like that. And then at the, I don't know. Hmm. I guess at the top we're going to have to put another hatch. Right? And then basically... Hmm. I might have to build all these walls up, though, to do that. Or at least the back one. Which is okay. As a matter of fact, would that, would that be okay? Let's let's just just double check, make sure we're putting it in the right spot. This is this has got me all shaken up here. Um, can we can we keep? Oh, stink! Am I too close? I might be too close right there. Oh, I might be too close. Ooh. Which means, you know what? If I make enough walls, how many do I have? Fifteen. If I make enough walls, I could just keep it closed in like this. Oh no! Oh oh oh! There we go, there we go. We could just go up like that and then create the, the hatch at the very top. I know it's dark. It's like, yikes, man. We come up here like this. Do we not have any more ladders? How many more can we make? Only two. Oh, stink. Probably just from the resources that we, we scrapped, right? So if we go up here like this, we're going to need a number more for sure. Wow. And then we can kind of make this... We could make this nice and get a hatch at the very top. I, I should make the ladders first, make sure we're all the way up. Uh, but then, you know what I mean? It's actually, it's not too bad. It's, it's way more of a production than I was ever anticipating, but that keeps us kind of safe, right? Actually, I think that is high enough. Look at that. It's like clipping right into the wall. Sweet action. Get in there, buddy. Okay, okay, okay. So let's, let's get, how do we get some, how do we get more ladders? What are we missing here? Um, fiber, fiber, we have tons of fiber. We got fiber for days in our in our workbench, so we we need that some wood. All right, let's, let's let's just let's just do this together, shall we? This is like a whole building project all of a sudden. Man alive! Okay, I wasn't expecting it to be this hard, but that's what it's going to be today. <laughs> that's okay. We we need the sun to come up and we need the the wind to change, anyways. So that's one of those things. Right, how many ladders am I going to need? Another six or something? Oh, that was convenient. Let's just take more of this. Do have my carry weight on ten, so I can actually get some stuff built without having to. Yeah, I don't have a front to this thing. Uh, oh, these horses, though, for real. Oh, I feel like just popping them in the noggin. Um, we're gonna put a ramp right there. We're gonna come in here like this. 
get our ladders going here. Let's see. We can just finish the other stuff later, right? We can just finish the, the stone walls later. But let's just see if we can get up here. Maybe one more? I can't really tell. Yeah, one more. One more. One more there. One more... Is this equal schmequal now? Let's see now. Okay, what just happened? Oh, I'm zooming out. Okay. Oh, gosh, that scared me. I thought I fell off my ladder. <laughs> okay. Oh, my goodness. Um, can I go like this? And then? Ooh. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. And like this. And we'll put a little ramp right here. Yes, man. That's what we're going to do. We'll come up here. Like, look. Okay, so over here, the reason I want to do... The reason I want to do all of this in the first place is because this is where all the iridium is. Now, can we... We might have to make a little thing here. Can we jump up here? Or do I... I don't think we can jump up on that. Or is it over here? Oh, I can I can get up there over here. Okay, very good. Well, maybe I should put like a little ladder thing here too. I know, we're just getting like involved. I just don't want to build up here because this is where all the stuff is. I don't want stuff being affected by that. There's like... Is this iridium? Yeah, there it is. See? Iridium. Oh, we were looking at that in the last episode, right? So there's iridium and uh, amethyst, I believe it is, all over the place in here. There's more amethyst. There's amethyst on the edge. And there's some... It's mostly... Let's see, it's mostly hidden over here. Oh, it's so dark. See, here, here's amethyst again by the trees. Oh, gee. Okay. Oh, my gosh, buddy. Really? All right, what's so we got? Like, <laughs> there's there's no hazards up here. As far as I know, there's more iridium. There's a whole bunch. There's a whole bunch. When you look in the daylight, there's tons. There's absolutely tons. There might even be some here. I don't know. Okay, it's not time for that. Let's go, buddy. Oh, snapping. Okay, we got, we, we, maybe, we, maybe we'll build something. I don't know. Maybe like a ramp or something. So, okay, what are we going to need? We need one ramp here. And we're going to need a bunch more walls. What do I have? Just two more walls. Um, We can't build that here because we can't do stone stuff here, right? Right. And then we can kind of come here. Maybe we should put some fencing up here so we don't go charging off of this. And we just climb down. Actually, that side is done. This side here. Oh man, oh man, okay, um, we can't look to the side, that's, oh man, that is annoying as heck. We can look up though. Oh, is that good? Um, yeah, I guess it is, I guess it is, how many do we, how many more do we need, just two more? That's that one, one, two, no, it looks like three more, okay, very good. Actually, it's not too shabby. That is not too shabby, in fact. So, two ramps, right? Maybe we should even put a door frame here. That way nobody can follow us in. That's, that's nuts. Okay, so let's see. I don't I don't know that I have what it takes here. Oh my gosh. The smallest little building thing is taking me forever. Uh, walls. We need three more. Alright, well let me make those. We'll be right back. If you're wondering why I didn't go with the... Um, what do they call these? Stone cliff platforms, which would absolutely be epic. It takes 40 organic paste, and so my issue with that is I can make one of these things, no problem. In fact, we can't stick it on the workbench. That would be really cool. Um, well, you know what? Let's put it here so we don't like lose track of where it's at. If I put it hidden in some corner somewhere. So if you make the mortar and pestle, um, where would it be now? Let's take that out. We need fibers, which there's tons of, but we need sap. And there's no sap on this island, and I didn't really bring sap. I have, I think I have a handful from when I was taming the... Get out of here. When I was taming the bears, these horses are unreal. They are just a hassle. You know, I do have some of those, but I don't really want to use up... I have, I mean, I have like six or seven, you know what I mean? But uh, you need 40. I don't know if you saw that here. So it's like, it, it is pretty sweet. Oh, okay. It is pretty sweet to have these things here. But you need like 40 organic paste, which normally speaking is not a problem if you have like honey or sap or, or whatever, some kind of sugars, right? But up here in the north, I guess that's not a thing? I don't know. It's it's not on this island anyways. So maybe that's something to keep our eyes open for, but I mean, we got four cargo holders there and they are uh, full. I mean, well, one's not full, but I don't really want to fill it with sh sugars when we have like sap trees back at our home base. So there's that. Uh, all right, so let's get this going here. Let's let's wrap this up, shall we? I'd like to see if we can actually maybe take off today. Get going. If if the wind cooperates, it'd be great. All right, so number seven is our walls. We want the red arrow pointing away. And I saw you, buddy. 
It's a, you can't look. I wish you could look around when you're on the ladder. That would be so sweet. Okay, right there. So it would appear that we can still stick some. I wonder if we can't. I think we can clip through that, but I, I, I might not be a good idea. And then number nine here is our ramps. A little ramp like that. Sweet. And I think we'll just... Oh, and now it's foggy. I guess we're not going anywhere. So is it late? I think it's quite late, right? Oh, it's two in the morning. Okay, so it's like literally the middle of the night. So, okay, well, I'm going to wait because I'm, I am still making ingots, basically. So I think I'm going to go flying off of this. I really do. I really do. I, 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 we got to put railings or something. I don't know. This is, or widen it out, maybe. Put two more and two more. I don't, and then just have a railing at the far end so we don't go run up here. And I think maybe that's what I'll do. I don't know. That's going to look weird. It's just going to look weird, though. I'm going to have, like, because I'm going to look up and then I'm going to have, like, these weird platform things floating. I don't like floating stuff, especially when it's stone. That doesn't make sense. No, we're just going to have to live with this. I think what we'll do is we'll put one railing right there and then that's that. But that's our quick way up, basically, in order to come get Iridium. Because, I mean, we can always just jump down, too. Right, with Iridium. Once we have Iridium, I think we can kind of jump down. We should, in fact... Oh, that probably hurts pretty bad if you do that. Maybe we should practice. I don't know. I think we're going to get hurt. It's not a good idea. So we could just climb down. Climb down like this. I think I kind of like this, as a matter of fact. Did we make all... We didn't make a... Um, no, we didn't. No. I made a bunch of stuff, but then I didn't make my uh, my door that I was talking about. At least I don't think so. No. We have one extra... But there you go. Like, that's not too bad, right? That's not too bad. Okay, so... Ah, traveling in the in the steam in the steam in the fog is not gonna be great. You come with me, buddy. As a matter of fact, no, no, you don't. You don't come with me. Let's just check on this. Let's see if we can load some of this up onto our ship. So there you go. Two stacks. It's still making more, which is good. What does this even require? It requires this stuff. So yeah, that's a bit of an issue too. I'll leave some of that behind. So four stacks is not very much, because we still have like we're making. What is this journeyman? I think. Yeah, Journeyman, which is our minimum right now. But there's also like Masterworks and Legendary and uh, what's the other one? Mythic. And they're all going to require that kind of material. Also, I put barrels because it did actually start raining here once. Look at that. I got a thousand water in each one. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, okay, so I'll tell you what I'm going to do up until uh, early morning here. We'll see. Get the luck. Let the fog go away. Let the maybe maybe the wind will change because of the weather. I don't know. Um, hopefully so. And then here's what we can do. We can jump into our ship. We're going to have three stacks of iridium ingots. I think that's enough. You don't, I mean, unless you're making cannons. If I'm making legendary cannons for my ship, I mean, but I don't think we're quite there yet. We might have to come out and do a little more gathering. But that's kind of why I have this this forge going in the first place. Is so I can make it and just come here with an empty ship and pick it up, right? Uh, and just do that. I don't want to have to carry, because otherwise I'm carrying amethyst or gems, which are super heavy, and the metal, which is also super heavy, when I can just combine them right here and make it into the stack. So it is exactly the same. See, 525, and then a 500 iridium is 525, and then, well, it doesn't show it here, but it's it's almost the same. I think amethyst actually is 525 as well. So you're cutting the weight in half by making it here first and then transporting it home. So I love that idea. That's fantastic. Iridium ingots farm. I should just call it ingot. I don't like them. I don't like that. Iridium ingot farm. There we go. I don't know why I had. There we go. Iridium ingot farm. There it is. Okay, so let, let me just pack up. We'll wait for morning. See what happens. So whoever told me to use the sextant while up on top in the crow's nest uh, for best results is uh, he's not wrong. Oh. Okay, so, and here's our issues. Uh, I got the sextant buff going. Uh, we got like a good 20 minutes on that, so we're gonna be just we're gonna be just fine. The wind hasn't changed. The the fog is gone, but now there's a heat wave. We're gonna be going pretty slow. Um, even if I have the, I can I can get pretty much at this angle that we're at currently right now. I can get full full you know full wind in the sails kind of thing. But uh, we're literally gonna be going. What is this? Just east? Yeah, north is that is kind of that way. Uh, you know what? It, we're we're kind of facing, you know, we're mostly east. I don't know if I want to be taken off of this whale right here. I, I almost feel like we should build, uh, a, a, like, a whaling ship. I don't know, like, how much damage these things do to us or what, but he's right in our path. They say the whales are harmless and you just, uh, like, um, wh what are the other whales? There's some whales that are dangerous, but they're further north, I guess. So we're probably going to bump into some of those, the, the ones that attack your ship. That's not going to be fun, uh, especially when we have, like, a ship full of loot. 
Uh, but these guys here, apparently, if you bump into them, it'll do some damage. And he's right in our path. These stinking whales. They just, like, spawn in here. and Maybe he's moving on. I don't know. Maybe he's moving on. I think it's probably very little damage. I don't know. I have no idea. And also, there's a heat wave, which is ridiculous. I put a heat wave. I still can't take my winter clothes off. Oh! Man. oh. Snap, and it's looking cold now. The heat wave is gone. Oof. What a view this is, though, for real. I mean... I mean, look at this. This looks cold, doesn't it? <laughs> it looks cold. So this is early morning here. And I guess we're taking off. What, what choice do we have? It's 4 in the morning. What choice do we have? We're not going to be able to avoid that guy. Here's, here's hoping we don't lose all of our loot. I don't think we'll lose our ship. We've got... What are we? How many guys we got on here? We got quite a few guys. We got two new bears. And we've got uh, a horse. So, what the... Oh, I thought that was my guy walking around. No, my guy's here. Okay. Uh, Riley's right there. We got some other... We got another crow. Just hanging out. Level 3 crow. Are you gonna come with us, buddy? Not likely. Uh, level 3. So, also, I made some campfires in case we get hot. I'm gonna bring... Well, actually, I packed it all away. Not, not in... I packed it away in here so we can actually access it while we're at, at sea. But uh, four, uh, actually four campfires and four stacks of full wood. So, oh look, I have ten paste right there. Yeah, very good. But you see, like I got all these seeds and this and that. I can't be losing all of this stuff. This is this is slightly risky. I, I don't I don't think we'll lose anything. We'll see. We'll see. He's right in our pathway though. Can he move on? That would be really spectacular if he did. All right. So let's just go like this. So if we start turning, let's go full steam ahead. Let's just see if we can't avoid him. I don't know. We're going to kind of go this way. Ships of the dam can be a problem. Everything's going to be a problem now. Because we're going to be going slow. That's just how it is. Everything's going to be a problem. We'll see. Actually, you know what? This isn't too bad. We got quite a bit of wind on our sails. And we're going... Um, wow, we're going almost northeast. Which is not terrible. If we have to zigzag, we'll zigzag. I just don't want to get too far away from the from land. Because that's where you run into bigger problems. These whales don't seem to come too close to land. So if we stick near land, we'll be good. I mean, I think, right? So here we are, 8.34 knots. Not spectacular. Wishing I could head towards that island right there. Just head straight north, right? Skim along the sides. But instead, we're going out to sea, it looks like. This is not going to be good. <laughs> this is not going to be good. The wind needs to change. It really does. Oh, my life. Unless... Unless we zig over that way. Can we zig that way and then back? What would be the difference? Oh. Oh, there's land right there. Oh, land is just like popping in. Hmm. So actually, we could go this way for a while. Zig in between there. Zag on the other side. All of that. Have the sun come up. Let's see. Can we... Uh, look at us. Look at our crew. Snapping. Look at the bears we got. This is, this is not... You don't want to be losing this. So, actually, what were we doing? Eight and a half knots? Something like that? Uh, sorry, 8.3 knots, maybe? Something like that? And I, th I think, normally speaking, we were doing 10.5. So, it's not awful. All right, ladders up, everybody. Ladders up. Last time we left ladders in the water. And, uh... Well, actually, we lost crew members last time we didn't have ladders in the water. <laughs> Very good. One does not simply sail with loot boxes on the side of their ship and have the ladders down like some kind of amateur, okay? Here we go. We are sailing. Keeping my eyes open. Absolutely ridiculous. I don't think we'll have much in the way of problems here. So we just we just seem to have like the whales that maybe you'll bump into. You can go whaling, I suppose, and get like um and take those whales out, but we'll get into that. But I wanna kinda swing by what is it, H fifteen at the very bottom? I gotta go up twice at least, and uh, up. I'm saying up north. You know, I gotta go north uh, uh, at least twice. I think three times, twice to get to one. Yeah, we're at three, so we gotta get twice up to one, and then from one we can get to fifteen. Uh, so three times, I gotta get through three zones. I don't think I'm gonna do that today. I really don't. After we just did all that building and this and that, but let's keep an eye on the wind. I would much rather be heading that way. I'd much rather be going north. But I guess I could swing. As a matter of fact, maybe I could swing around the right-hand side of this island straight ahead. It looks really weird. We don't want to get too close to it. And then zag back. You know, it's going to take some doing. But if the weather, you know, turns turns bad on us, at least we'll be near an island we can dock. 
I mean, we'll get as far as we can here. But... Alright, well, it seems like it's going to be pretty peaceful. I love this view. I'm not going to lie to you. That's awesome. I love my ship. I love the galleon. It's an absolute thing of beauty. It's just that we've got like four crates. So uh, this, this one here... Let me see. The crate on the left there... That one's got the ingots. I think it's got four stacks of ingots. And then the next one up in the middle of the ship... That's just iridium. And then we got amethyst and random stuff in the back here. And then on the side we've got uh, our tin there. Middle side. This tin that we picked up at another island. So it's kind of, yeah. It's kind of a pretty good shipload of stuff we don't want to be losing. But you know what? Uh, a galleon is still pretty tough. Okay, did the wind just change? I feel like I'm going slow. No? Okay, we're still doing 8.33 knots. We don't see that when we go. Yeah, we don't see anything when we go like that. Okay, very good. I'm going to skim around the side of this uh, island here. Hopefully, yeah, if we stay far away enough, like far out enough, we should be okay. Are there ships of the damned up here in the north? There should be, right? All right, well, I'm going to go for a while. We'll see how far we get here, and then we'll bring it back if anything exciting happens. And the way things are going, I think we're going to have to just park right here, to be honest. Ladder's down. Do I have a ladder in the front there? We kind of do. Let me just Z the sails right here. Lay down anchor. And maybe we'll do a little, exp well, not exploring of the, uh, well, this is a, big, this is a big island, but. Oh, my lantern was going this entire time. Fantastic. Well, it would have. Uh, no problem. In fact, we got oil on us almost all the time. Oh, where, where'd you go? Where, oh, there it is. The, the big red one, buddy. There we go. There we go. All right, so. Let's go see what we can find. Just discover this land right here. We might as well, right? We may as well. Um, what we got here? We, we circumvented. I mean, we got nowhere. With the wind in our... We, we were... Let's show you. I mean, we got to this island right here. That's, that's We went from here to here. <laughs> that's about it. We, we were sailing like this, right? We were coming this way. And for me to come back like this was, like, ridiculous. It, it was ridiculous. The wind is kind of blowing like this not really a southerly wind so much as it's, it's almost pushing us towards the east which is the exact opposite of where we, we want to go straight north which is really really hard and we're not going fast so i'm kind of hoping well i mean maybe we can get an h2 today i don't know i just want to go discover this Oop! come on buddy without getting eaten hopefully oh all right we got spring vaughn's enclave oh that's pretty cool anything hazardous here we didn't bring anybody with us so I figured we might as well make a couple of discoveries, right? There's nothing here. This is more more of the same. More of the same. All right. So, yeah, it's a bit of an issue. Also, do I have my spyglass thing on me? Here I do. You're supposed to be able to see, like, discoveries with the spyglass, but I never do. I only see islands. I, I don't see any, like, any other blue bubbles. Unless they're, like, maybe they're small. Hmm. You know what I mean? But if you look around islands, apparently if you... Probably from my crow's nest would be better than, than down here on the beach. But anyways, uh, you're supposed to be able to see, like, uh, blue bubbles. Like you do when you're... When you're spying out, the like, the uh, island, right? Oh, of course. This guy, for whatever reason. Alright, so, actually, as a matter of fact, do we have... Uh, is this the one that doesn't have the rope? That's the one we moved, right? Actually, a couple of them don't, don't, have, don't have rope ladders. Okay, very good. Very good. So let, let's just have a look at that, actually. Let's just have a quick look at that. I don't often do this, so let me let me have a look. Since we have the time, it looks like we're not going to get very far until that wind gets into our favor here. But it's just, like, working against us, and we're going so slow. I think we, we were doing, like, um, when I turn, you know, and you, and you have kind of, like, yellow sails or what have you, you're doing, like, three knots. And, I mean, we if we got attacked with three knots, we're not, we're not, yeah, we're not in good shape with that. So, yeah. yeah you know what I mean? Like, we look around the island here. And if there's any other discoveries on the island, it, it would show up as like a blue bubble. But, well, I don't know. Maybe sometimes you see it. Sometimes uh, it's it's obviously, this one's obviously obscured. But like that, like the, the first island we were on there, the um, the goat head or whatever the heck it was, that thing there uh, should have lit up, I think. Let's see, do we see any other islands out here? No, because we passed it. Okay. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So if you kind of look out there at the, out the sea... We also, we also circumvented a whale, but that was, like, boring, so... Alright, let's see here. You see how the wind is working against us here? So, north is... This way. 
If we went straight north, that would be okay. Get to that next island over there. You can kind of see it on the map there, H2. Is this fog coming in? Oh, now we got fog coming in. No, we're going to call it a day right there. I think uh, if worse comes to worse, I'll create a little hut right here. But it's not too cold. We seem to be staying fairly warm um, in just our winter clothes. But I think by H2 is certainly by H1. I think H1 is the Arctic, and so is H15. But that's where we're headed, so... It's it's going to be a bit of a project, it looks like, until that wind changes. H15 is what I keep saying. Yeah, down here, I want to get there. Apparently, there's iron wood. So, <laughs> we want to get to H15 and then somehow get our butts back to K. So, from here, depending how hazardous it is, either we cut across like this, which I don't really want to do. But, yeah, it would just be better maybe to go over to I, J, whatever, and then start working our way back down like that. We'll see. We'll see what resources we can pick up on the way. But there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this a crazy little ooh, ooh. All right. <laughs> this crazy little trip through Atlas. If you did, guys, don't forget to hit that like button. And hopefully, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.